Welcome back to the Arcana Network channel, where we dive deep into Web3 tech that is shaping our future. The Web3 space is growing exponentially with hundreds of blockchains and thousands of dApps developed every day. However, this has led to a lot of UX friction with multiple assets across multiple chains. Users have to deal with a labyrinth of tasks such as switching networks, bridging, swapping, buying gas tokens, and more. Let's take an example. Bob comes across an NFT on base chain and wants to buy it for 100 USDT. He checks his wallet and realizes he has 50 USDT on Polygon, 50 USDT and 0.1 ETH on Ethereum, but no assets on base. Bob now switches context to finding the bridges that are available for base blockchain and evaluate them based on cost, speed, and liquidity. Bob moves 50 USDT from Polygon, 50 USDT and 0.1 ETH from Ethereum as three separate transactions and waits for them to go through. Bob goes back to the NFT marketplace and finally buys the NFT. It took Bob four transactions with three bridging operations to buy one NFT. This further gets complicated if the price of NFT changes while waiting for these transactions to go through. Bob will now either have extra USDT on base if the price drops, or will have to move more USDT to base if the price goes up. This is simply too cumbersome for an average user. Introducing Chain Abstraction Chain abstraction removes the need for users to manage or even understand the intricacies of the underlying chains they interact with. With chain abstraction, users can operate across any blockchain, using any token to fund transactions, or pay for gas fees on any chain, without concerning themselves with the specific details of the network. Imagine it as Stripe for blockchain. Before Stripe was developed, international customers faced hurdles with diverse banks, payment methods, and currencies. Stripe revolutionized this by abstracting away the complexities of financial transactions. Once integrated into an app, Stripe allows users to pay using any method and currency from anywhere. Similarly, chain abstraction enables a seamless, unified interface where the blockchain's complexity is handled in the background, invisible to the end user. Now let's revisit the previous example with chain abstraction. Bob wants to buy an NFT on base chain for 100 USDT. His funds are on Polygon and Ethereum chain. Bob simply needs to hit purchase. Chain abstraction protocols will automatically perform the necessary steps in the backend in a fast and capital efficient manner. Bob is now funded on base chain to complete the purchase in just one step within seconds. Here are a few of the benefits of chain abstraction. It makes the blockchain experience straightforward and user-friendly. It reduces the learning curve for new users. It reduces the time and effort required to perform cross-chain operations. Users' funds are no longer split across multiple wallets or chains. Developers can build applications that are not limited to the capabilities or assets of a single blockchain. Developers can easily add support for new chains, tokens, and smart contracts without changing the entire app. How does Arcana fit in? Arcana's driving product design philosophy has been to abstract away Web3 complexities, starting with Arcana Auth, which abstracted wallets through its wallets as a service SDK, then abstracting gas fees with its gasless SDK, and now abstracting away chains with its chain abstraction protocol. This is made possible with Arcana's modular layer one for abstractions and intents. Arcana enables chain abstraction by offering a unified balance, a decentralized MPC network, liquidity abstraction with vaults and solvers, and gas sponsorship. In conclusion, Arcana's chain abstraction has the potential to revolutionize users' interactions with decentralized applications and blockchain networks.